nearly 24 hour search, six year old Amari Christensen has been found safe. We have live team coverage starting right now. Well, a little more than an hour ago, six year old Amari Gabriel Christensen was found safe near his home in Jacksonville. Amari got off his school bus at four o'clock yesterday afternoon near his home in the Gray Street area of Holiday City Mobile Home Park. The search was centered in a one square mile area around the mobile home park. And we have live team coverage in Jacksonville tonight. And we begin our coverage with Lucy Nelson with the very latest on what has uh, transpired there, Lucy. Frank, I was standing here when police made the announcement to everyone who had been searching for Amari. This was by far the outcome everyone had prayed for. Amari okay after being missing for nearly 24 hours. Six-year-old Amari Gabriel Christensen was found less than a block from his home at 430 today. Chief Yaniero says he fell asleep under a trailer and when he woke up and walked out, a neighbor called law enforcement. He says he thanks the community for their help and the more than 100 officers and public safety professionals who worked by ground, air and boat to try and find Amari. We've notified the family um, and we'll continue our investigation. We'll have to account for every minute that he was that he was missing, but we'll continue our investigation. Uh Yaniero says Amari is undergoing a medical evaluation, but again, as far as he knows, Amari is in good health. Reporting live from Onslow County, I'm Lucy Nelson with News Channel 12. And certainly some good news there, Lucy. Thank you for your report. Now, News Channel 12 Sharon Denko has been on the scene there all afternoon as well, and she's been talking with neighbors. And Sharon's joining us now live. And Sharon, what are those folks saying about what happened? Frank, again, Amari was found at 4.30 around this time. He says, well, his th people in the area say that he looked okay. Now, we got some video of an ambulance in the neighborhood just an hour ago. Now, we saw EMT and police go in and out of it. We didn't see Amari ourselves, but we are told that he is okay. Now, this is the result everyone was looking for, and neighbors tell me that they are ecstatic to know that Amari is home safe. Now, neighbors that I spoke to, they said that they spent all day and all night praying and hoping Amari would be returned home. They say that around 430 is when they normally see Amari running around the neighborhood, playing with neighborhood kids, running around, and he normally returns home around 6 o'clock. And that's exactly at the time frame that Amari did go missing. Now, police say they're going to continue this investigation, but neighbors say they're happy that he's home. Frank.